One of our most frequently asked questions is how do you close a batch uh, for your credit card processing from your point of sale? And this is done one of two ways. You can set up so the system automatically batches your credit cards at a specified time. And this is done by going into the back office, entering your access code, going to store settings, go to revenue and configure EDC settings. This will require that you have your EDC username and password. Log in and go to this station. You'll then set up an auto batch trigger time um, set up in here and you simply just need to put in the time that you wish to have the system batch. Uh, so like this is 9 p.m and click update. Once you've updated this information, you'll need to stop the service and restart the service. In my case, I will need to elevate security in order to do so in Windows, um, just simply by clicking elevate security and answering yes. It will relaunch my EDC configuration screen. And now I'll be able to stop my service and restart my service. And my auto batch will start now at 9 p.m. tonight. Now, if you wanted to manually trigger your batch, you can also do that by going into operations here, like this, enter in your access code, go to the revenue center and click close EDC batch. This will close any of your post authorized transactions. And in my case, I have no post authorized transactions. It'll give me an approval because I'm in demo mode. And it'll tell me what my batch count is um, that was sent to your processor. So just like that, we can be done. Your batch close time may vary based on your processor. Um, host capture processors will be almost instantaneous where terminal capture processors may take several minutes. Uh, but that's how easy it is to close your batch.